Last time on Celebrity Redemption, contestants competing in a hoedown and Stephen lost out in the public vote. Now, in tonight's live semi-final, only two of the remaining three can go through to tomorrow's final. And you decide, former WAC and singer Beth Macbeth. It's been such a journey for me and I don't want it to end just yet, so please keep me in. Everybody's favourite former child star and primary resident, Donna Duncan. Seriously, it's all about the money we raise for the charity. I'm just here for those poor children. And disgraced former MP, Malcolm Gray. Getting this far shows I've changed people's opinion of me. I want to move on with my life and put all that behind me. I just want to make my wife and kids proud. <laughs> I know, it's a funny joke. He's got all the warmth and charisma of a wet weekend in Dundee. Anyway, back to business. How much are you offering? Okay, I think we can do a deal. Well, yeah, I'm very serious about this. Well, she's a star in the making. You can't see this will be interested in that has been, can you? <laughs> I mean, you do want to sell your magazines after all, eh? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be in touch after the final. Right, cheers. Bye. On the phone to some of your stellar clients, are you? I'm surprised you care. Oh, I don't, Johnny. I just find it funny that you're still acting the big shot when the only clients you represent are wannabes and never gonna be. The same tired old acts that haven't been big since 1989. You'd know all about that, eh? <sighs> You think that starlet's going to take you to the big leagues? That's if she doesn't dump you first. Oops, sorry, I shouldn't have brought that up. That's funny. You were always bringing up stuff when we were together. <coughs> it's not right, Chubbs. Well, at least I could get something up. You know the little blue pills you can take for that now? She'd keep Beth around for a little while longer. Well, you could just fuck off. I'm not gay, I'm not gay. I just like big black cocks, but I'm not gay. Just doing it for the kids, eh? What a martyr. I suppose I built you a cross in your dressing room for you to nail yourself to. Funnily enough, no. But if you like, I could speak to them and get them to build some gallows for you. Hey, sweetheart. Oh, you look amazing. Have you thought about the red instead of the pink? Really? I guess whatever you think looks best. I really wiped them in the last task. Wasn't bad, but it could still be better. You need to nail it in the next task. I thought I did better than that. Well, you're ahead of Malcolm, that's for sure. MPs are never popular. He's no chance after his red boy antics. But Dawn is a different story. Okay, she's going to be harder to overtake. Donna, she's nothing. People will see what kind of a person she really is and how genuine I am. I don't think you're taking me or this show seriously. Look, I wasn't going to tell you till after, but uh, I've just got off the phone with Zed magazine. They've agreed an eight-page spread. Interview, photo shoot, front cover, the works. But only if you win. That's why we're here, Beth. <laughs> That's fantastic. It would be such a boost to my career. Imagine me in a magazine that didn't involve my outfit or the mistakes I've made. So all I have to do is win. Piece of cake. We both know I can do that. But you're not winning. She is beating you in every task. You're second in everything. I'm second in the tasks, but I'm ahead in the polls. Not anymore. Look. I haven't worked this damn hard for you to throw it all away now. It's all over if you don't win this. Well, don't you want to be known as something more than a ball-kicking idiot's ex-girlfriend? Of course I do! I'm not throwing anything away. I've given this my all. What more can I do? Do you want to win this? I have a plan to remove Donna from the competition. You're going to rig the next task. What kind of a plan? Why can't I just go out there and be myself? Well, that's not going to be enough anymore. In the next task, you all have to drink a smoothie. Put some of this in the drinks. Donna's allergic to it. It'll slow her down. What kind of a smoothie? Well, maggots or something. Eh. Well, that's not important right now. Well, 
almost kill her. No, 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 nothing like that. Look, they'll take her to hospital, she'll get a shot, she'll be fine. It'll work though, I and mean, that's what matters. I don't know about this, John. Why do I have to do it? Because you have access to the drinks, I don't. Look, just put a couple of drops in each one. If I win, this will always cheapen it. Look, if that's what you believe, fine. I think this is our only chance. Look, I lifted you up when you were down and out. I've given you everything I have. If I dropped you tomorrow, you'd be right back where you started. And nobody. That's what'll happen if you don't win. I can't afford to keep someone on with no work. Beth, we need you on set in five. It's your decision. But remember this. Donna wouldn't think twice about taking you out. Nice outfit. Good choice of colour. Thanks. You too. You shouldn't be so nervous. It won't help you in this business. You need to grasp every opportunity that comes your way. You need when to I... on set, Miss Duncan. <laughs> You'll learn. Miss Macbeth? 